Uh, I'm now going to go on the phone, though, to Amy Elliott. She's the chief of the medical examiner's office. Uh, Amy Elliott, thank you for joining me. We, we've had a report in the last few minutes of 40 more uh, bodies recovered, uh, making, we believe, a total now of 91 fatalities. Can you confirm that? I can confirm to 51. I have been told there are 40 more on their way here, but I can't confirm them until they get here. And are you expecting the toll to rise significantly higher than that still? Uh, yes, sir, actually I am. Have you any idea at the moment how many people in the end could have lost their lives? Um, I have no idea. I, I, I hope no more, but I'm sure they're coming. But just to clarify, 51 have been confirmed dead, and you believe uh, 40 more bodies have been recovered? Yes, sir. Absolutely devastating. Absolutely. What is your reaction to what has happened today? Because obviously it's the third tornado to hit more in 14 years, a huge one in 1999. This one seems to be even bigger, even more devastating. Yes. It, it's tragic. I wish that there wouldn't be any more. In terms of the rescue operation at the Plaza Towers School, can you tell me anything about uh, where you are with that? Well, actually, uh, we just become involved when the person passes away, so we're not involved in the rescue unit or the rescue uh, effort. Right, so you're only uh, notified when people are, are uh, confirmed as having lost their lives? Yes, sir, that's correct. And just for those viewers who are tuning in now, just to confirm, because it's important we get this right, uh, 51 people have been confirmed dead, including 20 children, and you're now telling us that 40 more bodies have been recovered? Yes, sir. I, I really appreciate you bringing us up to date. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Bye. Absolutely devastating update there. Uh, the number of dead almost doubling in the last few minutes from 51 to now we believe 91 people, including 20 children at least, uh, probably more given that new statistic. We'll be right back with the latest on the Oklahoma tornado.